Hey, it's Matt Larissa here with the Matt Larissa Group, a division of AmeriCorp Real Estate, bringing you September's episode of Concrete Jungle, a Chicago real estate story. We have a lot of big things going on here. We have a new website, thematlarissagroup.com, and we have a new video, Matt Larissa Group video, which you can Google or YouTube it at any point. It's also in the newsletter if you get our newsletters. Well, this month I want to keep it short and sweet, and what I want to talk to you about is the seasonal effect. The seasonal effect. A lot of people keep asking me about is there a seasonal effect downtown Chicago? Well, I don't really see that much of a seasonal effect as much as you would in the suburbs, because in the suburbs, people have kids that are coming and going to school, but in the city, it's not as prevalent. Uh, actually, I see a huge fall rush. Uh, because a lot of people have leases that come due in October and November, so the market still picks up heavily. And you got to remember that Chicago is a very transit city, so people are always coming and going. So that seasonal effect is not as big of a factor downtown Chicago as it is in the suburbs. The one thing I can tell you is that you may get a little bit less traffic, but the people who are looking are serious buyers. Well, guys, that's all I have for you this month. I'm Matt Literacy with the Matt Literacy Group, a division of AmeriCorp Real Estate, and I look forward to seeing you guys in October. Thanks.